Part 1, Wanderers of the Nebula. The Sigmas were nomads. Not by choice, but by circumstance. Their homeworld, Sigma Prime, had been a vibrant tapestry of life, its crystalline cities shimmering under a sky painted with three suns. But a cataclysm, whispered about only in fragmented data logs, rendered the planet uninhabitable. The Sigmas, a race of beings with elongated limbs and skin that shimmered like moonlight on water, were forced to flee into the vast expanse of the Orion Nebula. Their colossal vessel, the Ethon, housed the remnants of their civilization. Ten thousand Sigmas, each carrying the weight of a lost world, lived within its metallic womb. The journey stretched for generations, a slow crawl through the swirling nebula. The once vibrant culture became shrouded in a melancholic haze. The elders spoke of Sigma Prime in hushed tones, their words tinged with a longing for a past they couldn't return to. Amongst the younger generation, a Sigma named Alara emerged as a beacon of defiance. Unlike her elders who clung to the fading memories of a lost paradise, Elara craved a future. She devoured salvaged data logs, piecing together forgotten technologies and whispers of a mythical planet, a new Eden rumored to exist within the nebula. The elders scoffed at these tales, dismissing them as the desperate fantasies of a generation that had never known home. But Elara refused to be dissuaded. She rallied a small group of young Sigmas, their hearts ignited by a shared yearning for a future beyond the sterile confines of the Ethon. In secret, they studied the data logs, deciphering ancient star charts and forgotten engine calibrations. Their goal, to find this fabled planet, a new beginning for the Sigmas. One fateful day, Elara stumbled upon a hidden chamber deep within the Ethon. Inside, a single, deactivated scout ship lay dormant, a relic from a bygone era. It was a gamble, a desperate hope. But for Elara, it was their chance to break free from the shackles of their past.